this question of the right to the city is a question of surviving this era. We have to change our ways. A lot of social trust and relations has been destroyed by capitalism, making common goods or transferring them into commodities, like for example social housing, it's not social housing anymore. All cities are booming, there is no more space for people with low incomes. In my city, for example, it's quite evident that there's a lot of pressure of investment, especially in tourism, over the public spaces. Because of all those mechanisms and gentrify mechanism, it push even more old poor people away, so they have to get out of the cities. If the city was common, we would all have a share of this responsibility. In the last years, we've seen like uh, the merging of different initiatives, usually proposing very interesting ways of doing things and not waiting for the administrations to solve the problems. We make housing accessible for people with low incomes. The principle is that the ground is separated of the housing that is on top of it, and the ground is owned by a whole community called the Trust to take out the ground of the speculation that is going on in a lot of cities. These collectives are doing what somehow the public don't do well. It's really interesting because it's not exactly a public space. It's another kind of framework in terms of how relations are regulated. It's the self-management of, let's say, neighbors of specific resources. It's not only about housing, but also about uh, how a neighborhood can be nicer and more open for everybody. It has to do with the governance, how citizens or inhabitants in their neighborhood, how they come together using patterns of commoning to take care of their territories or resources. It's very interesting to see that all over uh, in Europe and even in the world, things are starting up and we should bring our experience together, I think, to make it stronger. It's very important that we have new forms of cooperation between the public and self-organized local initiatives. So for me, it's important to have arrangements that includes the users, the neighbors, and the public hand. And this is instruments that are not existing, but that we can build up. Now it looks like it can uh, be the only way you can fight the neoliberal um, development of the city and the privatization of everything that we, that we have. It can be really uh, become a uh, a way of make city in another, in another way.